stuff. All right, folks, we are now continuing with Deal or No Deal here. And just before the uh, commercial break, Joe Marr was given an offer of $50,000 to think about, and now he's going to tell us whether or not he's going to take that $50,000 offer or continue on in hopes of winning the $300,000 that he still has available to him. Okay. All right. Looking back at the amounts that are still in play, I have a 17 point 17% chance of having $300,000. Hmm. Well, you know what? As much as I want to take this offer, I don't want this video to be too short. So, I'm just going to sit. All right. No deal. He said no deal? Yep, that's what he said. All right, thanks for uh, the confirmation, because I couldn't quite hear him for some reason. But he did, in fact, say no deal. And, Jomar, that means you now select one case at a time. Yes. One, one case per round. Okay. All right. The case I'm going to pick for this round will be 18. I want to get the team numbers out of the way. And you got them out of the way on a very good note. Five dollars. Oh, yeah. That'll certainly make the offer go up. Oh, oh, it's my, oh, that's right, it's my go. All right, let's take... Yeah, it's your cue, Hunter. <laughs> your, uh, your offer now is 64000 dollars Sixty four thousand, okay. Oh my. Should I go for the three hundred thousand or should I take this offer and see what would have happened? Okay. I'm gonna play one more round. No deal. All right. Very good. Now you have the three, you have the five, you have the eight, and you have 24 left. Okay, yes, three, five, eight, and 24. Of those four, I'm going to finish the 20s with 24 and complete these. Come on, we don't want to see $300,000 in there. Well... Um, I wish I could be, uh, have good news for you on this one, but unfortunately, yeah, you kind of see where this is going. It's 300 grand. Oh, no. Oh, no is right. for a future showdown. I deserve a redemption for a future showdown. We'll think about that in the future. Yes, I'm taking this offer. Deal. All right. Well, $4,000 it is, but we still have some unfinished business left to attend to. Mainly, what's in the remaining cases? Had you turned down the $4,000, what would you have picked next? Okay, number five. Incidentally, 10,000 was the highest that you still had left, and you would have knocked that out had you kept going. Oh, okay, that was a smart move. And, okay, right. and the, ba and the okay. bank offer from Hunter would have been? 
$1,500. Yikes. And had you kept going after that, what would you have chosen? Okay, so $10,000 would have been gone in number five. Okay, next I would have said, okay, at this point, if my next case had been $5,000, then I made a good deal. Okay, between three or eight, what would you have picked? I, between three or eight, what would you have picked next? Of those two, my final choice would have been eight. Okay, number eight, and it was five thousand oh. dollars. So, I have a feeling that means you made a good deal for uh, selling your case for four thousand, and indeed you did, because uh, seventeen had five hundred in it. And let and let's take a look at that last one just for the record. The last one was three hundred. Well, four thousand. Uh, well, it's uh, not as much money as uh, what we gave away yesterday, but at least it's better than nothing, right? Yes, absolutely. All right. Well, folks, that'll uh, do it for the scheme of deal or no deal. We uh, thank you very much for joining us, and we will see you all again very soon. Bye-bye.